Hello everyone and welcome to this achievement run in Europa Universalis 4 and today I will be doing an achievement run as the Kingdom of France and the achievement I will be going for is Okay, here's the achievement. Azure Sem de Lisor. Get all the French cores as France. And in English, this means blue seamed with golden lilies. And that, of course, refers to the royal French flag and emblem that we can see right here. With the fleur de lis. Which was the symbol of the French monarchy. Anyways. So this is France in 1444 AD, and the king is King Charles VII de Valois. And our main enemy is the Kingdom of England, led by King Henry VI Lancaster. And we're still fighting the Hundred Years' War, but now there's a lull in the fighting, so we're not at war. However, I will be at war with England again soon. So I need allies. First, let's look at my Diplo screen. I'm gonna go... Okay, my enemies... Okay, I have my enemies. My rivals are gonna be Denmark, Hungary, and England. Okay. Now, I have an alliance with Provence. I'm thinking of Diplo and axing them later. But now I need to make some allies. So I could make an alliance with Brittany. and some other nations as well. But in the meantime, let's continue. And of course I can make an alliance with Burgundy, but let's continue first. Okay, now it's time to make an alliance with Burgundy. After, I could always just kick them out of my alliance and then go to war with them. Okay, now let me look to some allies in Italy. I can ally with Savoy. Okay, apparently we don't have a very positive opinion of them, but there are other countries I can ally with, like Venice, Milan, Genoa, the Papal States. I think I'm gonna ally with the Papal States. And of course, how can we forget about Castile? Okay, so I'll go for the... Okay. The alliance between me and Provence is breaking, so that just means I can go to war with them. Speaking of war, I must be prepared for war against England. So what I need to do is... Okay. I need to build some Latin medieval infantry and chevauche units. Okay. Okay, the alliance between me and Provence is breaking, but I'll just ally them again later. Okay, so if I go to war with England... Okay, let me, I'll, I'll look at that later. Oh, another country I can make an alliance with is Scotland. I'll definitely do that. Okay. So, my alliances look pretty good. I'll have the royal marriage with Brittany. Now, if I want to Diplo and X Brittany, I have to first offer vassalization, but I'll worry about that later. Hmm, what I really need to do is... I'm going to go for relations actions. I'm going to improve relations with Brittany. Okay, apparently the alliance between me and Provence isn't in danger of breaking. But I'll conf I'm going to improve relations with Brittany and Provence so I can Diplo and X them. I'll go to war with Burgundy later. Okay. Um, I'll accept. 
all decline, but I'll accept the Spanish royal marriage, or the Castilian royal marriage, to be more correct, as Spain doesn't exist yet. Um, instead, the Iberian Peninsula is made up of many different nations at this point in history. Okay, so if I need to go to war with England, which I will, okay, so I'm going to have to be at war with Tyrone, Ofle, and Portugal. Okay, Tyrone, Ophelia, and Portugal. Oh. Okay, only Scotland and Burgundy will join in in the war with Britain. Or England, I should say, because Britain doesn't exist at this point. It's just England, which also has Wales and the Pale in Ireland. But it's still the Kingdom of England. So, hmm. I gotta be strategic about this, of course. But I'm just going to be patient, so I'm going to go for that royal marriage with Scotland. Okay, my units. Okay. I built a force limit. Excellent. Now... There's my infantry. Now I need to wait for some more cavalry. Alfred Milan, a military alliance, but will they, okay, well they won't go to war with England either, most, okay, only Burgundy and Scotland will go to war, but I guess that's all the help I really need. And with Austria, they, I can't ally with them. I gotta take over Burgundy though before Austria can take any Burgundian land. I don't think Dutch... Okay, I'm gonna... I don't think Provence will accept me as their overlord. But let's... Let me look at Lorraine. Oh no, that's Provence. Where's Lorraine? Okay, that's Alsace. This is Lorraine. Are they allied with me? Okay, they're actually a junior partner of Provence. Okay. Okay, now I'm losing money. Well, I could always pay back my loans later. Okay, the Surrender of Maine. In exchange for accepting the Treaty of Tours in 1444, the County of Maine was promised to France. In practice, however, this still, this is, this has still not come to pass. The English have repeatedly evaded the question, and it is becoming increasingly clear that many in the English camp are arguing that the treaty will not be honored. In one last attempt to force the question, Charles VII has approached the county capital, Le Mans, himself and demanded the surrender of the city. The local commander, however, shows no signs of intending to open the gates, despite not having a force strong enough to withstand an attack. Time to the okay. Time to teach them how to war. Okay, now I control the main. Now I'm gonna march into Al Alenson, Khan, and Co. But I'll send I'll send one Okay, I'll send this cavalry unit into Calais. But first, I'm gonna call to arms. Okay. Okay, Burgundy's already. At, is Burgundy at war with England already? Okay. Okay, Burgundy. Oh, Brittany will accept. Provence will accept. Apparently, all my allies will accept. 
Okay, so let me send my infantrymen and cavalrymen into Aquitan and in Laborde. Okay, now it's time to call my allies. Okay, Burgundy is at war with England. Castile is at war with England. Brittany is at war with England. Milan is at war with England. The Papal States are at war with England. Basically, I have a complete anti-English alliance. So all the green are my allies, and England is my enemy in this war. And Scotland is also in my alliance, as I forgot to mention. Now... I could go for a naval blockade, but my navy's not that strong, so I'll still send one of these. Oh, okay, I'm still going to send my cavalrymen over to Calais. So let's continue. Okay, there's some Breton infantry. I have some infantry here. I didn't. Okay, I'm gonna send the. I'm gonna send this infantry to La Bird, uh, La Borde, right here. Okay, I've taken Aquitan. Let me send this guy down here. So I've taken most of Normandy. Now I need to take Condentin. Send this to Caen. Caen is the main city in Normandy, and there's a fort that needs to be taken. So, and same with Calais, that there's a fort that needs to be taken, so, yeah. Okay, I'm just going to keep soldiers all along the border with England. So I'm going to take my 14 infantry here and move them up. Because I think Spain has troops here, or Castile has troops here, so they can also fight England, if need be. I, where's my navy? All my navy is here. And it's not strong enough to defeat the English navy. Okay. But the idea isn't, like, to invade England or anything. It's just to, like, defeat their naval forces. In fact, Brittany's navy is pretty strong. Yeah. Okay. I'll have to wait for this. I, don't, I guess I'll have to wait for the, the English Navy to get weakened. Okay. Okay, Castile and England are fighting. No, I'm gonna get involved. Okay. Let me see if I can blockade the English coastline. Okay. I'm going to send this guy to Calais. You know what? I'll, I'll keep him here, but I'll send this one guy to Calais. Okay. Alright, now I'm blockading that part of the English Channel. I'm going to blockade Wales. Okay, and now Scotland is taking Cumbria and other parts of Northern England. So now I'm blockading... Burgundy's already blockading this part. Let me see if I can blockade the Dogger Bank region. No, no, someone's already... Okay. I'll, I'll just keep them in this part of the channel because my allies are already blockading England. Okay, now the Scottish are helping. Oh no, that's Holland. Okay, those are th th these are guys from Holland because Holland is a subject of Burgundy. All right, let's continue. Foreign drill instructor available. Maurice of Orange pioneered new drills for firearms that made the new weapons much more effective. This drill technique was not a secret, and numerous military entrepreneurs learned the drill and placed their service at the disposal of the crowned heads of Europe. I'll hire him. 
Now, I'm pretty sure that's not the same Maurice of Orange who led the Dutch during their War of Independence against Spain, because he was born much, much later than 1446. He was born, like, over a century later, so this is a different guy. All right, let's continue. Okay, these are Scottish soldiers right here. The Siege of Khan is over. I'm going to send this guy all the way down to Laborde. Okay, there's the English Navy. Maybe I can help out. The Breton Navy needs my help. Okay. Now I'm joining in. Okay, I won. Awesome. I'm going to go back to blockading the English Channel. Hmm, that might have been a little premature. But I guess, even if I had helped Castile out, I wouldn't have had enough ships to defeat the English Navy there. Okay, now my allies are invading England itself. So maybe I'll be able to take some land from England. Or free some countries like Wales. In fact, I'm going to go invade England myself. Because I'm just that insane, I guess. If my allies are doing it, why not me? Okay, get them all on. Maybe I'll get England to free Wales. Maybe I'll make Wales my puppet state. I don't know. Okay, the Siege of La Bird is over, but we're not done yet. Because I... I'm going to see if I can take Wales as a puppet state. And maybe I'll take the Pale. And annex that. Maybe try and... I don't know, maybe I'll try and unify Ireland. Or I'll just unify it and see which country unifies Ireland. Okay. Okay, I've occupied Dorset. Now it's time to go to Hampshire. What, what happened to my other... Okay, they're, they're going to be there soon. My other soldiers will be there soon. Okay. Okay, I've taken Hampshire. Now I'm going to take Oxford and Somerset. Is Urbino at war with England? I don't know. Oh, I, I guess they are. Well, that's because they're in a they're a vassal of the pap of the of the papal states. I'll let them take. Yeah, I'll let them take Devon, and I'll like. Yeah, I'll let Urbino take Devon, and I'll let... I'll let Urbino occupy Devon, and I'll let Brittany occupy Cornwall. Which is interesting, because the Cornish and Breton languages are related, so... That's pretty interesting. Right now, I'm going to take... I'm going to take Coventry. Am 
might take the Isle of Man. send these soldiers to Wales. Okay, there's an English army there, so I might need to run. I'm gonna run to, uh, I'm gonna run to Darby over here. There's a big English army there. I'm not ready to fight. Yeah, I'll give Savoy that. York. Now I'm going to occupy Scarborough, Scarborough and Lancashire. Okay, I'll, yeah, that's good. Occupy Gwynedd. Okay, now I'm gonna occupy Glamorgan. Okay, looks like the Ar English army is fleeing to Cornwall. They're stuck there. I'm not. Okay. Now there are English pretender rebels in York. But I'll fight those guys later. Okay. I'm gonna send my guys to Glamorgan. Take over what province is this? This is Montgomery. Yeah, I'm gonna occupy that. Let me send the rest of my guys down to Devon so I can fight the last remaining English armies. Maybe someone else will do with the Pretender rebels. I don't know. One friends in need. The queen of our illustrious king. Okay, the queen of our illustrious king Marie recently bought us a present from her family, House de Vola, ha, ah, House de Vola of Provence. Apparently, Duke Rene the First has been troubled with diplomatic scandals lately, and he has asked us, his most trusted friends, if we can help in any way. His letter is filled with compliments and our international reputation. His letter is filled with compliments on our international reputation and well-mannered representatives. Um, I'm going to go for a couple of our most talented diplomats will be sent to aid them. I'll go with that. Okay. Nah, the Burgundians, they can probably take care of the English. Yeah, they're still winning. Okay, so let me look at the France achievements again. Okay, there's this other achievement, the Big Blue Blob, where as France they have to hold 100 European core provinces before 1500. Now that is a bit more of a challenging one, so... One, two. Okay, so let me, let me make peace with England. Okay, clearly they'll accept... Oh, I can't take Calais? Why not? That sucks. I want Calais. Hmm. 
you know what? I'm not going to accept the end of this war until I take Calais, so... Yeah. Should I just be happy with this, or should I see if I can take Calais as well? Okay, apparently, I don't know. Okay, I think I'll just accept this peace deal as is. I can always get Calais later. Okay. Alright, and there I have gotten the achievement. Alright. Here it is, down there. Azure Sem de Lizor. And, okay, let me send all my soldiers back home. Because I can't, there's no use to have them in England. 